Hello everyone. As you know, eyes provide organisms vision, the ability to process visual detail, as well as enabling several photo response functions that are independent of vision. As you're watching this video, have you ever considered how this video would look if you were a cat? Well, in this video, we're going to look how the internet's favourite subject sees the world. The biggest difference between human vision and cat vision is the retina. A layer of tissue at the back of the eye that contains cells called photoreceptors. The photoreceptors convert light rays into electrical signals which are processed by nerve cells sent straight to the brain and translated into the images we see. The two types of photoreceptor cells are known as rods and cones. Rods are responsible for peripheral and night vision where they can detect brightness and shades of grey. Meanwhile, cones are responsible for day vision and colour perception. To put it in similar words, if you see a lot of colours, you have a lot of cones and you can see better in the dark if you have a lot of rods. Cats actually have a high concentration of rod receptors and low concentration of cone receptors. Humans have the opposite, which is why we can't see as well at night but can detect colours better. Now, let's take a look at the visual field. This refers to the area that can be seen where the eyes focus on a single point. It includes what can be seen straight ahead as well as above, below and to the side. As you can see, cats have a slightly wider visual field of 200 degrees compared to the average human visual field of 180 degrees. But in the aspect of visual acuity, which is the clearness of vision, the average human has a visual acuity of 2020. A cat's visual acuity is somewhere from 20, 100 to 2200, which means that a cat has to be 20 feet to see what an average human can see at 100 or 200 feet. This is the reason why cats seem to be nearsighted which means they can't see far objects really well. The ability to see close objects will be well suited for hunting and capturing prey. As you've probably already noticed, the way cats see colours is also quite different from humans. It's a common misconception that cats can't see any colours, only shades of grey. Humans are known as trichromats, meaning they have three kinds of cones that allow them to see red, green and blue. Cats are also thought to be trichromats, but not in the same way humans are. A cat's vision is similar to a human who is colourblind. They can see shades of blue and green, but reds and pinks can be confusing. These may appear more green, while purple can look like another shade of blue. Other than that, cats also don't see the same richness of hues and saturations of colours that we can. Even though cats can't see fine detail of rich colour, but they actually have a superior ability to see in the dark because of the high number of rods in their retinas that are sensitive to dim light. As a result, Cats can see using only one sixth the amount of light that people need. Cats also have a structure behind the retina called tapetum that is thought to improve night vision. Cells in the tapetum act like a mirror, reflecting light that passes between the rods and the cones back to the photoreceptors and giving them another chance to pick up small amount of light available at night. This is what makes cat's eyes glow in the dark. 